With the extremely unfortunate and unparalleled success of Souls RNG, which I've already covered on this channel before, we've entered the age of RNG games, if you will. Naturally, when idiots on Roblox see something that takes zero effort to create succeed and decide, hey, I can do that too, and try to get a piece of that cash money pie, uh, yeah, they try it. And that's today's video, because Souls RNG copycats are one of the worst things to happen to this platform in the history of this platform. Don't believe me? Well, I mean, just look at this shit. New Era, Aura RNG. What does this look like to you? If you guessed a shameless and blatant ripoff of Souls RNG, you'd be right. Is there anything in here that's unique? No, not really. Oh, wait! No, there might be. Look at this. You can fish for items. What does that do? Oh, good. More standing still. Guys, even Fish Game bothered to at least make a mini game for fishing, but in this, you literally just hit a button. So, how is fishing any different? from just standing still and letting the auto aura thing roll for you over and over and over again. It's the same mechanic. You haven't changed anything. But hey, at least these guys decided to put in their kind of visually impressing but completely underwhelming obby that you can do. So, you know, I bet you these guys were making an obby game and then they were like, oh, RNG, and they shifted focus immediately and just shoved their obbies in here. They've got two of them and, oh, would you look at that? If I complete it, it goes on a timer. Sorry, man, the most fun you can get out of this game is on a 10 minute timer. Good luck with that. And then the microtransactions. Just look at this shit. I can't make this up if I tried. All those idiots from the comments section of the Souls RNG video going, Herder dopamine, herder, I'm not even at my computer to see me roll it, so I just come back and number go up. Well, here you go. In this game, you can just f***ing pay for the auras. Yeah, you want a 1 in 500 billion? Pay us a thousand Robux, please. Give me a goddamn break. This is some of the most shameless stuff I've ever seen. Like, ever. Not just on Roblox, in my life. These guys aren't even trying to hide it. They're not trying to innovate. They're literally just copy-pasting a different game. And how many players does this have? 3,900. Basically, four fucking thousand. Are you fucking kidding me? Of course it does. Of course it does. Why, why wouldn't it- Why wouldn't it have 4,000 people playing the non-game? <sighs> how about- RNG Gods Alpha. Oh yeah, because I'm sure this Alpha game really, really needs a whole lot of development to get it up to snuff because it's so hard to make an RNG game, right? We need to make sure we slap on that Alpha tag so that way we're immune to criticism. Yeah, not a chance. So there's this little cool thing about RNG Gods Alpha, and um, that's that they allow you to sprint in this game. We're unfortunately lacking the ability to fish, which, you know, uh, real shame. Very riveting mechanic from the previous one, but at least in this one, I'm able to run. Why are you able to run? What's the point? Do you need to run to get anything? No. So they could have just not bothered, but... They probably were making a different game, and then they were like, Oh wait, let's not actually make a real game. Let's make an RNG game. Copy pasted the code, and sprinting just happened to be one of the first things that they worked on. Now you might be asking, is there anything in this game that would make you choose to play this over the previous game? Um, no. No, there isn't. Uh, wh what the hell did you expect? Oh yeah, by the way, uh, 1,200 people playing this one. Because of course, why, why wouldn't there be? Accurate RNG. Okay, now they're not even trying. Not only did you copy and paste the almost non-game of Souls RNG, but you also stole their thumbnail. Like, were you hoping that maybe somebody would just click this by accident while they were looking for Souls RNG? That's the only explanation. That's why they did this. That We know why they did this, and that's why. And you know what? They should have called this game Alpha 2, because this is more of an alpha than the previous game. 
somehow there's even less stuff in this. Oh, there's a little ring here. Who knows what it does, because it's coming soon. I doubt it. And of course there are people playing it. I mean, just look at these idiots. They've got their macros on, making sure that they don't get kicked for AFK, so that way they can flex their auras that they get in this game instead of any of the other ones. Thankfully, only 113 people got duped into playing this trash, but, like, what are you guys doing? What are you doing? If you're gonna play an RNG game, what made you pick this one? I would absolutely kill to have an interview with one of these seven-year-olds playing one of these Souls RNG knockoffs and just ask them, why this one? How did you arbitrarily go, yes, this sh RNG game that has nobody playing it is clearly superior to this other RNG game. And you know what? I might have found the answer. Because upon returning to Souls RNG, um, it's worse. It's more shameless. They did it. I didn't think it was possible, but they did it. Auto roll. Off. Group join required. You motherfucker. Are you fucking kidding me? No, seriously, are you fucking kidding me? You're duping the hundreds of thousands of dips playing your shitty game to join your shitty group in order to go AFK. If you don't join the group, you can't go AFK anymore. This is an addition. They did this on purpose. It was not like this before. They updated the game so they could inflate their numbers on their group. To all of the people who tried to defend these people by saying, Oh, well, you know, it just happened to work out this way, and they're not shameless. D no. Look. Look. Open your eyes. And really, all this stuff ends up doing is making me depressed, because I look at this stuff, and I look at 120,000 plus players, and I go, where did we go so wrong? There are hundreds of millions of games on the Roblox platform that are trying their absolute hardest to make a good game. And any potential players that they could have are being co-opted by trash like this. If 1% of the people playing Souls RNG went and played a real game, the platform would be a better place. Could you imagine if these 3,000 people that are playing this Souls RNG knockoff decided to go, I don't know, play a real game? Something that people actually put time and effort into? But no, that's not gonna happen. And people think a lot of this is an act. People think that this is all all like a big joke to me. But I'm not kidding when I say that when I look at this stuff, it makes me legitimately feel ill. The players playing these quote unquote games are the future players of actual games. And if this is the stuff that they're consuming when they're young, we're going back to loot boxes. Like that, that's what's gonna happen. We got out of the loot box disaster after Star Wars Battlefront 2 2017. And we're going back. If this shit continues, we're going back. And that scares me. Anyways, I, this is just fucking stupid. So I'm done. Uh, I'll see you next time and whatever.